Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen Wa salatu wa salamu ala nabiyyina Muhammadin Wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa azwajihi ajma'in Amma ba'd fa'audhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim Rabbish rahli sadri Wa yassir li amri Wa ahlu luktatam min lisani yafkahu qawli Rabbi zidni ilman ajma'in insha'Allah May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brothers and sisters, nice to see you. I told you that I would be writing. I didn't get a chance yesterday to write it. Today we'll start the, our session with this. This is a sample of what Dr. Abdurrahim is trying to write in a book form. Huh? Uh, selected verses of the Quran with its <coughs> grammatical analysis. And inshallah, uh, when he comes in October here, uh, we will launch that book and we will give you all of you a complimentary copy signed by Dr. Abdurrahim, uh, inshallah. Brother, this is from Surah Rum, verse number 17. Subhanallah. Now, you haven't studied this thoroughly, but I have hinted you many times. What is Subhana? Mafulun Mutlaq. It's a master. Huh? It's a master. Huh? It's a master. Mafulun mutlaq. Now, whenever there is a mafulun mutlaq and the verb, the fail and file are not mentioned, means they are mazuf. Okay? So, normally when you say subhanallah on your own, the fail and file is usabbihu. What is it? I glorify. I keep him high. Huh? Or you can say nusabbihu. Are you with me? Nusabbihu. When you say subhanallah, means usabbihu or you can say nusabbihu but what about here now this is a, a, a guidance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala it is a command 
to us. So, so what kind of a verb is hidden here? Okay? It is Amar. What will you be saying then? See, this is Mahzuf. Sabbihu. Huh? Sabbihu, subhanallah. Means all of you, the whole mankind, must huh, glorify Allah. Must glorify Allah. Are you with me? See, now, you can very well appreciate and, f- and feel it in your heart. Huh? When you... Read Subhanallah, then Allah is telling you, Sabbiho, Subhanallah. Okay, glorify. Huh? Glorify Allah. When? Hina. What is Hina? The time. Time, okay? Time. And what is Hina? Zarfu Zaman. Okay? At the time of when? When you enter evening, glorify Allah. When you enter evening, what, brother and sister, what is tumsuna? Uh, tumsuna? No, tumsuna is from amsa yumsi, from four. When you enter, no, as I said to you, that amsa yumsi can be fielun tamun, complete verb. With a file, or it can be fellow nakisun, then it will have a ism like kana. When you change the meaning of amsa and asbaha to become, then it is nakis. Become what? Okay? But when you enter something, then it is a normal. Okay? It will have a file. So when you enter evening, so where is the file? Wow. wow. Now what is this? Jumla failure. Are you listening, all of you? Huh? Jumla failure. Fi mahalli jar mudafilehi. Because you know when a zarf comes, there is a mudafilehi. So in this case, where is the mudafilehi? The jumla failure with fail and fire. No, brother, this is advanced Arabic. You don't talk like this in book one and book two. And not even in the beginning of book three. But we will come across this now in our next few lessons. And then, brother, harfu atf. And again, hina is zarf. You can say mautufun ala this. Okay. And what is tus bihona? When you enter, Morning. Huh? Glorify Allah when you enter evening and when you enter morning. Are you with me? Tusbihuna. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I should. I corrected it and then again something happened. See, again, Tusbihuna, all of you. That wow is antum, the whole of mankind. Okay, brothers and sisters? So. And then what is Tusbihuna? Again, it is Jumla, complete, with file. Failun, mudariun, marfun, bi thubuti noon. And file is the wall. And then Al Jumla tul fi'aliyatu fi mahalli jarrin mudafilehi. This is very advanced. Huh? But there is such a beauty in it when you understand. And we do not have to do the analysis all the time. If you do once or twice, then your mind understands it. Brother, wallahu. Okay, brother. And what is this lahu hamdu? Okay, lahu. Jar mazur, shibu jumla, khabar. Hamdu muftida. And again, jar mazur. Right? Okay. Now this wallahu hamdu is a parenthetical sentence. What is it? You remember? I give you an example. Kala Allahu Ta'ala. That is the parenthetical sentence. Kala Rasulullahi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. What is Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? Okay. Uh, 
Huh? Or we can say Kala. Huh? We take all the Khulafai Rashidin and we say Radiallahu Anhu. Or if there is a sister who is a, a, a Sahabi, we say Radiallahu Anha. Huh? So what is this Radiallahu Anhu and ad, Anha? These are all parenthetical sentences. So here, this is a parenthetical sentence. Are you with me? Huh? And only once we have a deep knowledge of Quran, we can then understand it. Or the scholars will guide us. Uh, that this is a parenthetical sentence. Because the message is something else. And this is the praise of Allah. Uh, this is the praise of Allah. Allahu hamdu fissamawati walad. And then, brother, what is this? Arfu atf. And what is ashiyan? Mautufun ala hina. This is also uh, zarf. It describes a time. Okay, are you with me? Now, this in in one of the scholar has described as the as the asar time, the time of asar. Well, Maghrib and Isha will be in Tumsuna. And Tusbihuna is the morning. And Zohar time. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So again, Wahina, Mahtufunala, Hina, the time, Zarfu Zaman, and Tuzhiruna, when you enter afternoon. Glorify Allah. Glorify Allah. Okay. And Azhara, Yuzhiru. And the file is, file, file is, wow. Are you with me, brother and sister? Now, uh, many scholars, okay, have said that the five times of prayers uh, are derived from this. You know, five times of prayer are derived from this. Okay, so this is it, brother. This is the way, inshallah. We will be studying and we will understand each and every word. Now, do you understand each and every word? Yes, Alhamdulillah, we understand. You know, that's the way, inshallah, we'll carry on. Huh? Which one? Yes, 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 yes. Brother and sister, whenever Zarf will come with a single fatah, then it will be. Mudaf. Huh? And we are going to learn, inshallah, soon. It's coming in our dars. That portion is coming, that rule is coming in our dars, inshallah. Jesus, sir. The whole, uh, glorify Allah when you enter evening and when you enter morning. To, to him belongs all the praise in the heavens and in the earth. And glorify him Ashiyan, at the time of Asar. And at the time when you enter the, the, the noon period. Got the idea? This, this applies to everything, brother. Sabbihu subhana. Subhana, whenever Subhana comes, the fail file, a jumla is mazuf, brother. And we got to understand and translate it. But in this case, it is Amar. Sabbihu. Okay. Inshallah. Brother and sisters, I requested you to go through the Ra'a, Yara, and Ara, Yuri. I hope you are all comfortable with uh, Ra'a, Yara, and Ara, Yuri. Huh? Okay. Now, what is the Amar of? What is the Amar of Ara, Yuri, Ari? Remember? Huh? And if it is a monas, Ari with Ya. And if it is a, a 
Antum aru. Huh? Huh? And if it is uh, Antunna, arina. Huh? Inshallah. So this is what Dr. Abdurrahim is trying to explain. Uridu an uri al mudira. Ara afal min ra'a. Asluhu ar'a. Huzifat minhu aynuhu. Mudariuhu yuri. Inshallah you understand that. Yuri, fe'lun mudariun, marfun, wa alamatu rafai, adammatul mukaddara. Fine. Wal amar minhu ari. How will you define ari? Fe'lu amrin. Mabnun ala hazafi harfi illa. Arini hadha ya Ali. Show me this. So ya mutakalam is your first uh, mafulun bihi. And hadha is your second mafulun bihi, brothers and sisters. Okay. Aruni. How will you define aruni? Fielu amran. Mabnun ala hazafi noon. MashaAllah. Very good. And where is the file? al uh, that is your file. And then Nunun Vikaya and Ya Mutakallim and then Haza again, Bafulun Bihi number two. Brothers and sisters, what is this? Arena. Arena. Arinani. Are you with me? Arinani. What is this now? Felu Amran. Mabnunala Sukun. Okay, Hunna and Tunna are always Mabnunala Sukun. Mahali Jasmine, you can say. And what is, where is the file? Nununiswa. Okay, you, you, you missed it. You missed it, brothers and sisters. Let me write down. What is this? This is for Antunna. Let us start with Anta. Turi, Turiyani, Turuna, Turina, Turiyani, Turina. How will you define, define this? We are doing Marfu only. So you will say, you will say, Felun, Modarion, Felun, Modarion, Mabniunala, Sukun, Fimahali Rafin. Are you with me? Or, because we are conjugating, so it is in the, in the marfu halat, but if it was mansu, you will say Fimahali Nasmin. If there was a lam, you will say Fimahali Chasmin, because there will be no changes in this verb. Okay? And then where is the file? Nunu Niswa. Huh? This is your file. Huh? Okay? Now, brothers and sisters, make into Amar. Padasan, only one chop. That's it. No more. We cannot drop the noon because this is not that noon ata jata. No, that is not the same noon. This is a file. So, what will you bring now? Okay, so what will happen now? What will be your uh, Amar? Arena. So how will you define this? Fellow Amri. Mabniunala Sukun. Mabniunala Sukun. Fimahali Jasmine. Because all Amar are Majzun. And then where is the file? Noon. And then there is a Noon Vikaya. Huh? Are you with me? Noon Vikaya. Okay. And then Ya Mutakalim, brother and sister, is your Mafulun Bihi. Huh? Number one. Mafulun bihi. Number one. And haza is Mafulun bihi. Number two, brother. Are you with me? You got the idea? Inshallah. Takulu, you say, Aran al Mudarisu, Kitab al Nahvi. Jadidan. What is the sentence, brother? Aranal Mudarrisu. Aranal Mudarrisu. Kitaba Nahvin. 
جدیدن The teacher showed us the new book of grammar. Fine. But the ara, how is ara written? Not with the alif maksura, but big alif. So, ara plus na change into ara na. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, what is ara? Huh, brother and sister? Fiyanumadin babnunala fatahtu mukhatta. What is na? Mafulun bihi number one. And what is al mudarrisu? Fail. Where is mafulun bihi number two? Kitab. Wahuwa mudaf. And then nahwin mudafili. And what is jadidan? Where is the manut? Kitab. Kitaba is the manu, mashal. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Very good. Ghadan, the deserf. Sa'akhuzukum ilal maktabil a'ama. What is the meaning of maktabil a'ama? Public library. Tomorrow, I will take you to the public library. Wa'urikum. What is the meaning of this? And we'll show you. Uri. Felun. Mudariun. Marfuun. Bidammatil mukaddara. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu. Ana. And kum is your mafulun bihi number one. Where is mafulun bihi number two? Al-majima. Okay, then what is this? Kullaha. Emphasis, mashallah. Tawkeed. This kullaha is tawkeed. And what is ha? Mudafilehi. What is it? Mudafilehi. Of course, this refers to all the mojum. But here, kullaha, mudaf, mudafilehi. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Arini. What is arini? Fellow amrim. Mabnun ala hadafi harfi illa. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takadiruhu anta. And nunu vikaya. And what is the ya mutakallam? Mafulun bihi number one. Where is the mafulun bihi number two? Jawaza. Wahuwa mudaf. And safari mudafilehi. Wahuwa mudaf. And ka mudafilehi. Ya Ahmed. Show me your passport. O Ahmed. Now comes the interesting things, brother. Fit Tanzili in the Quran. Okay. Wallaqad. Arayna hu ayatina kullaha. Fakazaba wa aba. This is referred to the Fir'aun. Okay, brother. Now we are going to understand the the expression lakad. In in all languages, there is a special way of expressing something, you know. And in Arabic, also there are many, many ways of expression, and they are so beautiful, uh, which cannot be translated, uh, which cannot be translated. Okay. So, lakad, brothers and sisters, what is lakad? This, if you wish to write down, you can write down. Lakad. First we say la. What is la, brother? What did I write? Uh, what did I write, brothers and sisters? Allamu. Lil kasamil mukaddarima. There's a kasam there. Whenever you will see lakad, there's a kasam there. Okay? Now, and what is kad, brothers and sisters? Harfu tahkik.
That is why you will see in the Quran, brother. Watini, wazaituni, waturi sinina. And then, brother, wahazal baladil amin. Now these are all kasam. And after that, lakad. Now comes jawabu kasam. Huh? So when the jawabu kasam is affirmative, huh? only when it is affirmative, you will put la there. Huh? So brother, these are all beautiful things which cannot be translated. You have to learn the language to feel the magic, the eloquence, and, and the sweetness of it. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So this is it. So when you see any time lakad on its own, then the kasam is mukaddara. Mukaddara. Kasam is there. And sometimes you will see the kasam and lakad coming together in the Quran. So here, lakad has come. The kasam is mazuf. You know? Okay. Arayna. Where is the verb? Uh, aray. 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 Because these are mutaharik pronouns. So, lam kalima gata. Sukun. Uh, you have to understand that. Arayna. Where is the file? Na. What is who? Mafulun bihi number one. Where is the mafulun bihi number two? But the ayati, how can that be mafulun bihi? It's a kasra. Mafulun bihi is always a fata, brother. Hassan, I'm asking you. What's your reply? Jama muanna salim. What is it? You forgot? You knew it? MashaAllah. If you could figure out this, what shall I say? Shabas. Huh? May Allah bless you with Mona. Did you feel Nasreen also? Mashallah. But I think sometimes we know it, but we forget. Remember, Jama Mona Salan is Mansub Bil Kasra. Huh? So this is Ayati is Mafulun Bihi number two. Wahua Mudav and then Na Mudafile. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Are you with me? I hope you didn't get lost. Hafza? Abir? You, you, you feel it? You understand? Inshallah. See, brothers and sisters, when you come to the class and we go through this process, it will only make you strong. And strong. And when you study Quran on your own, Inshallah, you'll be able to figure out. Huh? Okay. You will not get lost. Huh? Ayatina. Kullaha again. What is kulla? Taqeed and ha? Mudafilihi. Fakazaba. So he denied. Right? Called it. These are all lies. Fakazaba. Aba. What is the meaning of kazaba? It is believed. He said these are all lies. And Aba. Aba. What is mudaria? Aba. Ya Aba. Refused. He refused. Huh? He declined. Huh? The simple meaning is that we showed him, that is Fir'aun, our signs, all of them. He disbelieved and he refused. Okay, he declined. Are you with me? Inshallah. Now, number two, Sister Maimuna, I'm asking you, Huwa, what is Huwa? Muftada, see? No problem. Where is the khabar? Allazi is the khabar, mashallah, mashallah. He is the one, huh? is, he is. Remember, Muftada khabar, there will be is or R or M, okay? He is the one, okay? So, huwa, huwa, Muftada. And where is the khabar? Allazi. And Allazi has come, what is Allazi? Ismul Mausula, then we will have Silatul Mausul. But let us analyze the words first. Yurikum. Huh? So what is Yuri? Fehlu Mudarium. Marfun bi dammatil mukaddara. Where is the file? Mustatil. Takdiruhu. Huwa. Yadullu Allah. 
Allazi. Yadullu Allah. Allazi. Here it will be Yadullu Allah. Allazi. And Allazi is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yuri kum. What is kum? Mafulun bihi number one. Where is mafulun bihi number two? And now you cannot make a mistake. Brother, how will you define ayati? Huh? Mafulun bihi mansubun bil kasra. Then you will write down. Liannahu jama mu'ana salim. That's the way you will write down. Okay. Wa huwa mudaf. And then. Mudaf ilihi. Fine. Well, you, and then. Harf atf comes. Wow. Huh? Yunazilu. Now yunazilu. You know brothers and sisters. Can go to. The yuri. Can go to yuri. Mautufun ala yuri. Okay, for you not zilu lakum for you, menas samai and rizkan. What is rizkan? Mafulun bihi. Anything more you want to say? No, brother, just mafulun bihi. Because this mafulun bihi is for you not zilu. Nazala, you not zilu, only one mafulun bihi. You not zilu rizkan. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? So, Sister uh, Naima, he is the one who shows you his signs and he brings down for you from the sky risk. risk. See, inshallah, what I am aiming, brother and sister, that we will understand the Quran in its original composition. You know, you will understand all these words, what they are, huh? inshallah. Number three, brother and sister, is, huh? that is zarf. What is is? Zarf. Kala Ibrahimu. What is Ibrahimu? File for Kala. Huh? Rabbi. What is Rabbi? Ya Rabbi. <laughs> so, Harfunida is Maduf. Huh? And Rabbi is Mudaf. Are you with me? Mudaf. Uh, and it is Mansub. Uh, it is Mansub. Okay. Mansub bil Fatahatil Bukaddara. Okay. Alama uh, Kabla. Ya. Okay, it is before the ya. Okay, so if there was no ya, you would have seen that fata. Are you with me? And where is the mudafilehi? Mahzuf again. Mudafilehi, ya mudafilehi is mahzuf. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Now, arini, show me. Arini, okay, show me. Ari is fellow Amarin. Mabnun ala hazfi harfi illa. Where is the file? Musatir. Takdiruhu? Anta. Anta. Yadullu ala rabbi. Are you with me? Where is the second mafulun bihi? Kaifa tuhyil mauta. This whole sentence is your second mafulun bihi. Okay? The whole sentence is your not kaifa, but the whole sentence. Okay? Kaifa. What is kaifa? Ismu istifam. What is it? Ismu istifam. Tuhyi. What is tuhyi, brothers and sisters? Fialun mudarion, marfun bi dammatil mukaddarao. What is the madi, sister Madina? Ahya. And how do you write ahya? It's written like this, brother. Ahya yuhyi. Form 4. Form 4. Okay. Kaifa tuhil mauta. How do you give life to the dead? Brother, mauta is plural. Singular is mayitun. What is the singular of mauta? Mayitun. Kala, now this is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Kala, 
אבל למ תאומן? למ you know, okay? And brother, what is a? Harfu istifam. And what is wa? Harfu atf. But it came afterwards. Why? It's Queen Victoria. Hamzatul istifam will not allow anybody to come in front of her. Everything has to follow. Okay? Especially if it is harfu atf. Wa, fa, thumma. They will always, always follow Hamzatul istifam. Fine. Alam, you know lam, brothers and sisters. Harfu nafiyin wa jazmin wa qalbin. Okay. What is tomin? Feilun mudariyun, majizumun bi sukun. Fail mustatil, takdiruhu anta. Very good, brothers and sisters. Kaala. Now this is Hadrat Ibrahim saying. Kaala. Bala. This is harfu jawab actually. You know, bala. Walakin. Harfu atf. What is lakin? Without shadda. Have we studied this? Inshallah we'll soon study. But I've hinted you many times. It is the lighter form. Uh, what is it? Lakinna is the proper form. Lakin, lighter form. What is the difference? Meaning wise, no difference. But the difference is, if you use lakinna, then it must have a jumla ismiya after that. And lakinna must have ismu lakinna and khabar lakinna. But if you use lighter form, then you can use it anywhere. Jumla ismiya, jumla failia, uh, doesn't matter. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Here we are. Walakin. Li. What is li? La mutalil. Huh? In order to. Are you with me, brother? What kind of verb is this? Yatmainna. What kind of a verb is this, brothers and sisters? We haven't studied. So, uh, you, I won't ask you for sambosas. <laughs> okay? <laughs> you haven't studied. Huh? Okay. But soon we are going to study. Huh? It's a very beautiful verb. This is like fel fulafi, mujarrat. There is a fel rubai mujarrat. Remember I told you, tarjama, zalzala, harwala, basara. These are all fel rubai. Similarly, there is a fel rubai. What is it? Tamana. Now in the fel rubai, also there are derived forms. Mazid fihi. Huh? So this is one of the forms of fail rubai, mazid fihi. And what is it, brother? What is the verb? It ma'an. We are going to study this. There is a whole lesson for fail rubai. A very beautiful lesson. Okay. It ma'an. Make it mudaria. Yat. Yat ma inno. Are you with me? What is the meaning of itma anna? Huh? To to be to be assured. Huh? To feel assured. Huh? Or to feel peace, comfortable, tranquil. Huh? To feel in your heart. Uh, it is intransitive. Does not need mafulun be. You feel assured. You are at peace. You have no doubt now. Huh? Everything is clear to your satisfaction. You feel satisfied. Huh? Itmaanna is to feel satisfied also. Fine, brothers and sisters. Itmaanna. So, li yatmainu. Five in your pocket. Uh, you can say that. But, okay, let's leave it at yatma'inna because the verb is yatma'inna. But when you put li, it will become yatma'inna. Got the idea? Okay, now let us try and make mustar. Those who know Urdu, they know it, but they cannot spell it. Mutma'in is ismufa'il. Mutma'in is ismufa'il. Mu. Okay. 
What is it? It cannot have its own maful. Why? Because it is intransitive. All these things, we must have it in your mind. Huh? Okay? It will not have its own maful because it is intransitive. Very important rule huh? to remember. Okay, brothers and sisters. What is the master, sister? See, I told you, you know it, but you cannot spell it. Huh? Because you got to understand it ma'anna. So when you say itminan, sometimes you are eating away hamza. You are too hungry. Okay? So what will be? It it me it me na Got the idea? You don't pronounce that way. Huh? You always eat your Hamza. Are you with me? What is this, Sister Maimuna? Sister Aisha? Sister Maria? Mustar. From Itma Anna. Yatma Innu. Itmi Anan. We say Itmi Anan, but it is Itmi Anan. Okay, brothers and sisters, I'm taking a lot of time. Sister Abir, I'm trying to explain you all in detail. Uh, taking extra time so that you feel how we are going to study Quran, brothers and sisters, inshallah.